son The only one who never had a fairy growing up I was told to run until my journey is over Alright, hello everybody, we're gonna um, continue playing Wind Waker, and if you like that song in the intro, the link to the download is in the description. Um, and today we're probably gonna make more progress than we did last time, hopefully. Um, I believe we were on our way to Grandma's house, and I'd show you a little trick where you collect the piggies and you uh, put them in the pen, you give them to the lady. Unless this is like a started over save, and it's not gonna be good, and then we're gonna have to restart recording. But I don't think so, unless this old man yells at me. No, not this old man, exactly. Um, okay, so no, this is the regular save. Um, we're gonna go in here, this is a grand- Or oh, actually, a good little money trick. You can go right under here, press R to crouch, and you kind of do a little army crawl. And, uh, the, you know, little what, arrows tell you which direction you can turn in this. Little maze up. On um, Windfall Island, which we will be going to actually not too far away. And you get an orange rupee. Some people want to save this until later in the game when you need more money, but honestly, I'm I you can carry 200 rupees and you you can just fill them up because you know you're gonna get a lot. You're gonna get a bigger wallet eventually. So, all right. <coughs> mm. And actually, up ahead, we're going to be doing um, some combat stuff too. And hopefully, I'll figure out how I can do that the quickest because I don't feel like running that whole thing. Where did I just go? Okay, I'm going to go with this. Oh, where's she? Look down. Grandma? Grandma? Oh, there she is. Oh, lady. I've been waiting for you, right? Oh yeah, we got the hero's clothes. Look at his face. Oh god. He's lucky to be wearing this. Come on. Even though he's in a tropical island. No. I'm not gonna do a grandma voice. Um, I'm not. I'm not. I'm gonna actually let you guys read them. I'm not gonna like. I'm gonna shut up and then read them. So. All right. So now we're gonna just change right in front of her because you know that's how it works. All right, and she's just kind of explaining how this was kind of a, on their this birthday. This they were kind of told to be men, but and you get like you learn to kill and like have a sword and stuff, you know. But we're gonna learn that anyway, so don't do that. And she gives a little hint on what we're gonna do. Orca, who we've talked to already, I believe, or we haven't. Um, he lives below where that um, big guy with the big head lives, and then the shield also a little foreshadowing. Just remember that's there. Now we're gonna change this on that. That's cool. Alright, now we're a little unsure of ourselves, so, um, yeah, they a perfect fit, I guess, a little tight. Alright, birthday party! I actually, I want to look up how old he is, because I think that'd be pretty cool. And she's going to make soup for us, which is also kind of a little foreshadowing. Um, this, once you get later in the game, you get bottles and you can use soup. And then her soup is so goddamn delicious, it makes you want to, like, gives you all your hearts back, it's awesome. Or most of the hearts. I can't remember. I don't really use the soup. I what did I do? I used fairies. Fairies were really useful. All right. So now we have that. We can go see Ariel again. We are way over there, up there. And Ariel's look up. So we're gonna do a little barrel roll over there. Um, and to all of you who I probably, I probably won't be talking again, um, happy holidays, because, you know, it's getting close to the, um, Christmas day, and I'm pretty excited. I know I'm getting, a uh, Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword, I'm so, I'm pumped, I'm hyped, I'm ready. That and, uh, Scrim, getting Scrim, Scrim, too. And also, if you like those little, um, cut videos, the, uh, like the... A, a pawn kill. I was kind of shitty. I kind of threw it together, but um, I think it was so pretty. I think it was like a milestone. It's like the most editing I've done for a video, and I think I'm gonna have a Red Dead one coming up soon. But um, anyway, back to this. Um, she's making. She's like telling us about. Yeah, she's making fun of us. 
stupid little girl. Can you close your eyes and hold out your hand? Oh, what are you gonna do to me? Oh, happy birthday! Oh, na -na -na. oh hell yeah. But telescope, telescope. So it's a Y, Z, or X. Alright, now we're gonna equip stuff. Yay! Um, equip. Shut up! Ah! I need you to tell me what to do. Just go get kidnapped or something. Okay, great. Alright, I'll go look at the mail man after. Alright, so to equip stuff, we're gonna press the start button and we're gonna go to start screen. And you're gonna equip this by pressing Y, Z, or X. And, um, I like my telescope on Y. Y. Okay. Um,. The save button is also there. That's useful. Um, and so now I'm gonna look at the telescope to the mailman. And he's gonna... Huh? What? 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 Oh, man, he... Oh, man. Oh, well, wait. Oh, okay, I'm looking. There he is. There it is. Oh, man, that... That pedophile bird. Oh, disgust me. Oh! Here we enter the epic tomb, read of the pirates. They're pretty sweet. Alright, so now our actual adventure begins, and we get to start, um... Well, we get to start our adventure, I guess you could call it. And... The young little pirate girl falls to the forest, that is crappy reanimated actually, that's pretty bad. Um, and now we have to go get her, because, you know, we're good people. I know, I know, I need to go. Alright, so, we need a sword, so, I think you can guess where we need to go for that? It's not, oh, crap, oh, crap, uh, you also have a swim meter. That's a little thingy, swimmy thingy. I gotta stop saying tutorial stuff, pick up the rock, and, okay. Ah, oh, get away from me. Disgusting rodent. Get an asshole, please. Yeah. Alright. Hmm. Okay. I think we're gonna. Uh, oh, why do I have to keep talking to you? I hate you. All I do is catch pigs for your wife. Uh, disgusting. Alright. Alright, let's go talk to Orca, who is, um, pretty badass. And there's an actual mini game we can play with him later, which is also very fun to play. Um, but for now he's gonna teach us the way of the soul. You have some urgent look about you. Has something happened? Whatever it is from the look on your face, I speak there's no laughing matter. What you say you need. Come for some the way of the soul. Okay, great. Yes, sir. Okay, so great, now we're just gonna teach us to use a sword. Horizontal slice, face me, press B. Just don't, just don't lock on, just don't, just press B. Just like that. I usually lock on, like, it, with enemies in the game, you kinda wanna lock on, unless there's like a big group of them. I mean, I guess sometimes you could just do that, but here, here we go. This is the vertical slice that we're gonna be using a lot. Lock on, down, and then press B. And here we go. Now L and B forward, like that. You can really, you can see the thrust really well too. Oh crap! And he does that if you do it wrong. And that bird-like noise he makes is really annoying. Like that. Shut up! It's crap! Oh god. Um. Okay, alright, I got you. Let me take it so hard. Right. Spin attack, alright, so be careful not to hit him there, because whenever you hold B, you just automatically tap, so go like this, and you do spin attack. There's also another way to do it by moving the control stick around, and then, there we go, yeah, and then pressing B. But what am I doing now, jump? No, okay, sorry. Alright. I'm just gonna do it. Okay, great. Parry, alright, so now he's gonna hit us, and when we see the, we hear the beep noise, the thing, yeah, like that, and then our A button lights up in the top right corner. We can do like a sweet barrel roll, or I think, hopefully I can get it to show, come on. Nope, okay. You do a barrel roll and you swipe around the back, or you can jump and you do like a really cool, like, um, 
attack in the air, like to attack their head. You know, jump attack, one of my favorite, my favorite, just all time favorite. Some people like spin attack, I think I like the jump attack. Which I think is really misunderused. I don't know, I see a lot of people use the spin attack, I guess. Alright, I see certain ancients in this, and the sword you hold. And I guess you can guess what's gonna happen here. Oh, yeah, you're gonna give it to us. Then I know. The hero sword, will it with B. Use it wisely and carefully. You don't want to let the condo man who entrusted it to you down. Wait, did I read that? Yeah, I did. Since the olden days, the sword has been used to fend off evil. Its blade is infused with the desire to become strong and righteous. Be strong. Grandpa, you do have a beer belly um, and a tattoo. I don't think if I, I should be taking advice from you. But anyway, um, that's it for this episode. Um, I hope you guys have a very good Christmas, very good Happy New Year and stuff, or Kwanzaa and Hanukkah. And I will talk to you um, probably in a week from now. And may, let's see what's changed then, and let's see um, what's going on. All right, so bye.